I ain't gonna lie, I was not sure if I wanted to play this, bro. But then, as soon as I heard this song, I immediately was excited to play this. Yo, what is up, guys? It is Trey here, man. We are back with yet another video, another episode of Lotus. Still ain't figured out how to say this word, okay? I still ain't figured it out. Reverie? All right, that's, that's as close as we gonna get. We are back with this game. I do not actually remember too much of what happened last time, so we're going to have to re-remind ourselves. It's been a month. I did check um, a little bit of the, what was it, the second episode? I think it was the second episode. I checked out a little bit of it, see if I could remember the voices that I had and stuff, but that's completely out the window. The voices, they're going to be completely gone, okay? We're going to have new voices, most likely, because I'm probably not going to remember a single word, a single syllable how they sound <laughs> i don't really remember as much as what happened when we last left off if i'm not mistaken i believe we were um we just fig we just got in some in some type of i don't we we really didn't even honestly get the gist of what was going on before i left i'm noticing that it says new life i'm hoping i don't have to restart um game stop at the choices i knew I knew there were choices in this game, bro. I'm, I'm mad excited for that. We still ain't we still ain't made it to a single choice. I'm trying to figure out, okay, the museum. Okay, those, those are definitely memories that we've seen. So I think that's it. So memories, organize, back. Wait, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. Okay, I was gonna say it, I put it on Espanol. I'm finna start tripping. Okay, so I think, I think this is how we, um, this how we started? What? Auditorium? Huh? What? Do we click this? This was like the last scene, if I'm not mistaken. Or is this one? It was definitely not this scene. Oh, wait. Six out of six? One out of one? I don't even know. How do I get back? Okay. I think it is new life. <laughs> okay. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right. I just got a notification on my phone. I don't I hate that noise. Why did they use that? that specific noise for it i don't i don't know new light hold on hold on hold on hold on game game i have progress in the game bro i have progress why am i still seeing this okay let's just skip past this bro i've already i've already written this bro i hope i don't skip nothing if, if i do it'll be all right oh this is when it fucking turned up oh man Oh man, this is yeah, that's when it turned up. And then uh Shoddy, yeah. Oh, this is a perfect recap. I'm fucking tripping. This would have been the perfect recap for me to to, to let y'all know what's going on. Okay, so yeah, we are the capital of the kingdom. This girl right here, I believe her name is Maya, since it says it uh right there. Um I believe she wants to kill us because of that bloody scene that we just seen. Um and because it was an old man getting his head bashed in and it, honestly y'all guys are just gonna have to watch the other um the other episodes first episode is gonna be kind of a drag the second episode is mad lit it's gonna get right into it so i would advise y'all go watch those episodes before y'all come and watch this one i'm gonna leave the playlist link into the description and i also have the link uh i also have the playlist on my channel so you can go and find that Oh, if I hit A, if I hit um, if I hit X, it'll go ahead and skip for me. I think the black robe. Yeah, we've read this. We've read this. We read this. I remember. I remember saying you was booty ass naked. Uh huh. Uh, we got Shin Kuei. That is the that is our main character. We have the nervous boy. I honestly forgot your name, bro. I'm I'm not even gonna lie. Uh, yeah, I do remember his voice though. His voice was definitely rememberable. <laughs> All right, does it blah 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 that creeped me out okay yeah, let's get let's get past all this because y'all y'all if y'all have already seen this then y'all are gonna be kind of annoyed all right let's go he yeah we need we need questions from ryu with the blood on himself um yep some people that i call a bind okay i remember you how did i talk how, did, how was Colabine's voice don't remember this was um um rosemary yeah 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 and then this is big big body big boss okay 
Right, here we are. This is exactly where I left off, y'all. Thistle. Who is who is who is Thistle? Oh, I think that's um uh that might be the dude on the left. Maybe the nervous boy. I don't I don't I, I, I forgot. What's the current status? I'm just my voice. Ready to roll. I checked the cameras and the security systems are up and running. So we can finally relax after last night's disaster. Okay, hold on, hold on. They thought since, <laughs> Lotus, y'all thought since I just got into the gameplay that I wasn't gonna be peeping clues? I know I peeped that one, I peeped it. So we have cameras and a security system. For what exactly? What are we eating and why do you have the tiniest shot glass ever? Okay, we're just gonna ignore that. I don't know what what type of liquor is that. I don't, I don't know. Is that uh Pink Whitney? I think that that's Pink Whitney. Breakfast is ready. Feel free to grab a bite anytime. Violet is the girl on the bottom, on the top right. Yeah, so I think Thistle, Thistle, Trissle is on the on, on the left. All right, feel free to grab a bite anytime. Um, what happened with? Oh no, his name was Helio. What happened with the fire? All under control. That's dude on the top left. You keep avoiding the word extinguished. So who is this? Is that the is that big boss? Big 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 body big boss? I think that is big body big boss. In any case, hold on, how do I how is his voice? In any case, <laughs> I would like a summary of everything that happened so that we can all be on the same page. Okay. I feel like my boy in the middle, he kind of he kind of giving me Levi vibes. I'm not going to lie. You, you know, badass, um, ladies all on them type shit, um, fan art, huh? I think I can handle that, boss. Rose raises her hand. As if in a as if in a class at school, she clears her throat while the rest of the group all listen intently. Okay, all right. Are these are these are these are they in high school or are they like you know grown? I I, I really I'm really lost here. I'm pretty sure you know what I'm saying the the power outage from last night has been temporarily fixed, so the electricity should be working like normal. We are currently using the emergency generators until we can find out what exactly went wrong with the main system. Yeah, y'all can see that I'm trying to fill out my voice. I'm trying to get my voice um, ready for my reading. So right now I'm not doing no, I'm not doing no voices right now. I'm just trying to get the emphasis on the right words. The failure was indeed suspicious, but we cannot be sure. But we cannot know for sure if it was a mechanical issue or a result of someone's sabotage. Fuck. Someone sabotaged. I don't know what's going on. Like, game, please explain. I'm I'm so ready for this. Even if it was the latter, we don't have any visual evidence. So, you know, anybody could have really done it. Ro Rosemary opens her mouth to continue speaking. But Thistle interrupts her. How do you pronounce that? It's Thistle. I don't like that name at all, bro. Um... Isn't that like a plant too? Isn't Rosemary a plant? He's a plant. What's up with all these plants, bro? Like, I don't know what's up with y'all. Do y'all do y'all have the devil's lettuce? Okay. <laughs> y'all got all you got every other plant. I imagine the blind spot in the surveillance no longer exists. Okay. Indeed. I took care of it personally. In fact. I honestly don't know how it happened in the first place. That mistake is gonna make it extra difficult to create a list of suspects. Damn, I read that one fast. It's not like that list is too long right now. Okay, I think I, I have like a, a a voice that I wanna do with Rosemary. I'm gonna do kinda like a, a like a, a push up your glasses type of type of type of sound. Um Columbine sneakily glances in your direction, although her voice was just a whisper. She manages to direct the whole room's attention onto you. And that is the girl in the middle bottom. Columbine. Uh, sound like a um, uh, carbine in, in Colombia. That's what it sounds like. It gives me uh, gun vibes. Wait a second. There's another possibility, right? 
there could still be other people hiding somewhere, right? Shinkwe was proof of that. All right, so they found me. A mix of murmurs and grumbles fills the all, all sharing the same lack of convention. Not her. I don't. Honestly, she looks just as happy as when we came here. We've already discussed that many times, dear. You know, there's no one else alive on this side of the river besides us. Of the river. Uh, they talking. They talking in the uh, UK. You know what I'm saying? That they call it across the pond. <laughs> Even if there was, we control all food and water, Helio. That's without even mentioning all of the security systems. What? So you control, you control all the food, the water, and the security systems. You mean life? <laughs> like what else is there? Okay, but it happened. Like, don't we have living proof of that? Shinkoi Sh 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 says that she remember something like a hospital and none of us here have visited that area we all know who is in charge of scouting that zone that's the only reason we're giving this girl the benefit of the doubt i talked too fast for him i was too fast for him once could maybe be a miracle two would be impossible okay were you smart ass the traitor you can feel the group's spirits plummet at the mention of the word traitor. Even Helio assumes a defensive stance with his arms crossed and avoids the subject. All right, so this seems to be a game about... So, okay, bro, is this going to be on some, like... What what game was that? What game was that where, um... Um, um... Dang and Ropa, Dang and Ropa. It's gonna be on some like Dang and Ropa type shit. So it's like you gotta, you gotta. I'm, I'm assuming you got like a killer or something that's in between these people, and they're gonna off somebody or something. I don't know. I don't think that would really work very well with this. Like, there's not many people, and in Dang and Ropa there was like 15 or something. So I don't know. I don't, I don't think that's exactly what they're doing, but maybe they're gonna off somebody. Who is my favorite character, bro? I don't even know, bro. Kind of Helio, a little. I like Helio because I like doing the nervous voice. Uh, even if the risk is small, it is never a waste of time to take precautionary measures while we keep our main focus on restoring power. All right, all right. What's up with, uh, y'all ain't took one bite of food, bro. Y'all been staring at me the whole time, bro. Like, is we, is we gonna eat? Y'all ain't gave me a plate. I ain't got a chair to sit down. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yo, this the hospitality of these guys suck. Like, bro, I, didn't I just come here? Y'all ain't y'all can't even give me one of those stale ass apples on the on the table. The emergency system won't stay up forever. So that should be our main priority right now. All right. So Rosemary, what do we need to repair? What do we need to repair it? The girl takes a mo a moment to think about it before answering. Mm, mm, according to my calculations, we could always take a trip of our electric substation to see exactly what our diagnosis for our troubleshooting shall be. You're gonna hate me for this, but could you go there immediately? I know you haven't slept much, but like, I'm the boss here and I've been doing everything since the beginning. I just need you, somebody to pick up some slack. We got an extra person and y'all still ain't got nothing to care of. Helio sucks. Colobon's always asleep. Rio stay killing somebody and Violet stay flirting with somebody. So um, I'm really kind of tired of having to carry this team. Can so, can you actually go in, um, 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 yeah. Sleep, who needs that? But. <laughs> <laughs> who needs that? Like, who needs sleep? Fuck, who needs it? But in that case, in, in exchange, I want to select who comes with me. Uh oh, Rosemary. Rosemary. What you going? Who? Hold on. Who are you choosing here? Who going with you? Who's going with you? I mean, I see no problem with that as long as you know you don't do no freaky shit. Uh, then. Rose leans back on her chair with a smirk. 
I can already, I can actually picture this. Everyone else carefully follows the direction her finger is pointing. It's obviously gonna land on me because she's looking dead in my soul right now. You, Shinkwe, I want you to come with me. Nani? At this, at this absurd proposition, everyone's face are unform unformally surprised. Some stand up and others burst out laughing. This was forced to quickly take action to control the chaos. I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna start reading with Tarda. I'm, I apologize. I know that's probably annoying. That's quite hasty, but sure, you can go with Shinkwe if you wish. <laughs> if you wish. <laughs> Yo, you, you, you're gonna let her go that easy, huh? Kalabar, how, ain't you supposed to be like, ain't you supposed to be the one that's like, my character is like, romantic interest or something? Like, aren't you supposed to step in the way of this? As long as we respect the regulations, like, you know, no freaky business and, and, um, and no, uh, uh, booty business, then there shouldn't be any business. At this, at this moment, not only must we gain Shinkei's, Shinkei's? Shinkwe, Shinkwe's trust, but Shinkwe must earn ours as well. By the way, Shinkwe is a, a is, is, is Italian for I think five. Um, this old uh smiles as he addresses you. Helio stands up, slamming his hands on the desk. I will accompany them as well as the third person. Sorry, Helio, I had someone else in mind. Uh, s someone else? It shouldn't matter as long as there are three, right? Um, I mean, I'm afraid we will have to make an exception this time. I am your boss, so I will fire you. I want Ryu to be the third. Huh? Ryu? I don't know about Ryu, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Ryu? Ryu? I don't know, bro. He gave me all vibes, bro. He, the first scene that we see of him, he got blood all over himself. I mean, this it. This is a game, I think, I mean, um, this is a, a, a universe where we kill things, though, so. Guess that's not too wild. But it's still wild, though. Like, it's still wild. I just can't get past it. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a, I'm a human, I'm a human being, bro. Seeing that is just, that is just raises red flags, regardless of what the situation is. Okay, but because you have extensive experience in this field, isn't that right, detective? Oh, he's a detective? Mm -hmm. Why in the world did I let everyone know? <laughs> eh, it's a drag, but I guess there's no one better than me to keep an eye on a totally not suspicious individual here. And he's the monotone one, too, so I definitely don't. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Ryu points out brazenly. I've, I've never heard that word, so I don't know what it means. Uh, the case I would rather you focus on. Wait, the case. I would rather you focus on the case. Bro, I hate the name Thistle, bro. Aren't aren't they one and the same? All of that talk about trust seems to have fallen apart hastily before it even had a chance to really get off the ground. After some more give and take, everyone eventually calms down. Except for you. Yeah, I know. We have questions to be asked, don't we? <laughs> I don't like how the music cut out. That is all. If no one else has anything else to add, I'll just murder you. <laughs> but that's, what I, that's the vibe I'm getting right now. This will cause a conclusion to the meeting. Meanwhile, you are utterly overwhelmed. You look around helplessly at the other's faces while trying to figure out what to say. All right, I'm gonna try to make sure to keep a lot, keep my voices on now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to transition to continuously doing the voices. Okay, what was your voice? Great. Then we can formally declare this meeting. Okay, that's what I'm, that's exactly what I'm gonna get at, nigga, bro. <laughs> that's exactly what his voice gonna sound like. Okay, so this is gonna sound like a politician. <laughs> uh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. The group is already starting to stand up from their seats when your trembling voice escapes your lips. They immediately turn their gazes to you. I didn't know she was trembling, I'm sorry. Um, what about me? Numerous questions circle through your head, making it impossible for you to find the words you need. My memories, I, I can't remember anything. I don't know what's going on. 
Where are all the people? What are you talking about? Where are all the people? The hall is still. Nobody dares answer. Your voice quavers as you continue. Are you, are you about to cry, my nigga? Calm down, bro. Oh my God. Why we always have to get the character that's so cry, baby, bro? Why are you crying for? You ain't, you ain't seen, you seen straight smiles this whole time, bro. You seen straight smiles, bro. What is the issue? Why are you so pressed? Why is your voice quavering and shit? Why aren't you just killing people, bro? You didn't, you didn't have any memories then, bro. You was just, you was just with a bit that was, um, I don't know. She was like some like evil ass, I don't know, succubus or some shit. I don't know, bro. <sighs> I don't even know what the what these regulations you keep talking about are, bro. I just don't know what the hell is happening. I just don't understand why all of you are taking it so lightly as if as if as if all of this is nobody told you. Huh. You shake your head. This will let's out a sigh before answering. Ideally ideally, you should have started from there. Oh fuck. The music still ain't came back. I'm getting nervous. No, the music back. The music back. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> the problem is, you know, we don't have much time for that now. The the electric. No, what? Uh 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 uh. Nigga, what? You can't do that. How is that? How? how nah, this shit. Oh, nah, the suspense. I can't, I can't, I'm not ending another episode without me figuring out what's going on. Problem is, we don't have much time for that now. The electric substation is the number one priority right now. Not your life. Look, both Ryu and Rosemary can take care of some of your questions on the way there. Then once you come back, I promise, I'll answer any other questions. Sorry, my, there go the voice going away again. The duo reaffirms Thistle's promise, re resigned, resigned, and exhausted from that outburst, you, re you reluctantly accept their proposal. I do know what that word means. <laughs> I just didn't know how to say it. There's just one thing you need to know before anything else. The regulations we follow in this castle, their word. You know, you will die if you don't follow them. You we will literally decapitate you and throw your head uh, in the water, okay? You'll naturally learn them as you live here, but you know, there are two basic ones that you need to know because if you don't comply, there are problems. First one, you might have already guessed. We can only leave the castle in, in groups of three. No more, no less. Meanwhile, all of the other members must remain inside. Oh shit. Three? Okay, okay, I'm starting to piece things together. Those things that we was fighting in the first episode, I'm thinking it's coming in this episode. So they're gonna, you know, I guess, I don't know, I guess we can't go nowhere without being, you know, with, with a group. Otherwise, we'll die. Everyone seems quite convinced about this word, but none of this makes sense to you. <laughs> and now the second and most, and, and most important regulation. This will put his hands on his hip confidently, puffing his chest out. For as long as you remain within these castle walls, you must collaborate to stay alive. Shit. And that includes you. Simple, right? You don't answer. They're finishing up. <laughs> they're finishing up the meeting anyway, so it doesn't seem to matter. <laughs> it's like you don't answer. <laughs> uh, and I won't forget. I won't forget oh i won't forget i don't know how to do it everyone voice with that unusual farewell the group dissolves deep in thought find yourself unable to get up from your seat still silently trying to assimilate everything you just went through especially that second regulation as long as we so the second regulation was do not forget as long as we remain within these castle walls why so specific? Holy shit. Do not forget me. Who was talking? Hold on. Where we at? We just on the street with it. <laughs> we just on the street with it. We got the we got the jam sport. 
Where the Starbucks at, bro? I, I gotta stop by the Starbucks, bro. I fuck with Starbucks. I don't know if y'all fuck with it. I don't, I don't, I don't really... doesn't really matter. Uh, <laughs> she quit. The truth is... This place is enveloped in a veil of silence. The streets are clear, traffic, noise, or any signs of life whatsoever. Okay, bro. This... Okay, I might need to stop acting so uh, giddy because I don't I don't think this giddiness is gonna last very long. I'm really tired. I didn't sleep at all. Oh, she was like, you know, she was putting on a front. I I, I ain't gonna lie, I fuck with that. I fuck with that. She putting on a front like like fuck sleep. You know what I'm saying? I wish I could do that. I could never say fuck sleep. I'm not gonna lie. I don't. I did it a couple times. You know, I might be like, I don't want to work type shit. I don't want to go to work, so I'm gonna just stay up like fuck sleep. Okay. The reign of emptiness is a menace in and out of in and of out itself. You have no idea what might be lying in wait around each corner. What might be hiding in each swaying shadow? Hold on, they said Ryu was a detective and he's with us right now with Rosemary and me. Therefore, good night, huh? Oh, she's gonna fall asleep. But the same cannot be said. Of your companions on the trip, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I thought she was finna murk my nigga, bro. <laughs> Are you seriously going to just let go of the wheel like that? What? Is she driving the car right now? Rosemary chuckles, breaking her playing possum act with the threat of crash looming ever closer. Closer. You are you are forced to scramble from your passenger seat and grab the wheel. Hey, okay, okay. So Shinkwe, she not gonna let herself die. I fucks with it. <laughs> Who is? You avoid a tragedy thanks to your quick reflexes and cool head, but it seems you are the only one in this vehicle who's even remotely worried. Damn. Careful there, you made some donuts drop on the floor. <laughs> head ass. Careful there. <laughs> Thank God. There's the 13 second roll. What in the world is the... Wait, how can you just lay there so calm? What are you gonna do, find me? It's not like we're gonna run anybody over. We could just crash. You know, just saying. You know, we could kind of like lose our life. Oh, yeah, true. Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> I like his nonchalantness, though. I do like it. I do like... I like I like people with a nonchalant attitude. I didn't read that that, that last one. I think I'm gonna be all right not reading it. Let's recall, because it's auto. Um... It's okay, Chinkoi. We're just trying to have a good time here. Don't be such a party poop. Oh, wait. What kind of crucial... Wait, wait, wait. Okay, this kind of crucial... This, this kind of crucial information should have been disclosed before the drive. Yeah, you know, I guess I had to read this. It's okay, Chinkoi. We're just having a good time here, man. Don't just be such a party pooper. Weren't you sleeping? Like, you talking about partying and shit? You over here dead asleep. Could you please take the... Could you please take the will before we die in the horrible inferno? <laughs> Doesn't seem to me like you're doing too bad for your first time. If you were here before when the incident started, you would have never believed what people got up to. Oh yeah, according to my calculations, there ain't anyone around to tell us no. Fuck! We had quite a bit of fun playing bumper cars with real cars. Or setting cars on fire. Enjoying the ensuing explosions. Long jump competitions with cars. <laughs> Why? Why is her accent like I cannot get her voice right for some reason? The nerd voice. I'm struggling so bad. That was country. That was that dead was nerd to to uh uh country. I don't know what that was. Long jump competitions with flaming cars. I hate myself, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I really hate my voice acting in this video. No. Oh. Can this music? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, bro. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. That shit is loud, ain't it? <laughs> Hold on. How I go to the menus, bro? No, no. Oh my god. Memories organized? Like, what is this menu, bro? What am I even. <laughs> there it is, here it is, here it is. Dude, the music volume is already so low. Yeah, it's gotta be like here. That shit's still loud a little though. <laughs> you know how you barely managed to steer the car from the passenger seat. Rose leans in her chair back, rests her head on her hands, and lets out a deep sigh. 
but of course you're you i imagine you're still in a raving panic phase i'm, I'm gonna just give her i'm gonna give her a normal voice bro i could get over it if you at least tried to take your foot off the gas pedal you know during those turns <laughs> It's completely different for us. All of this madness started so long ago. Like, how long has it been? Like, two or three months? I've lost track, to be honest. That really ain't that long, to be honest. Yeah, around that time, I think considering how much, how almost all the food is either on the verge of expiring or has gone bad. Those donuts, too? Mm, most likely, yes. <laughs> Maybe you should check the expiration date before you gobble up the next one. Did you not just hear what he said? He, there is no food. <laughs> Everything is inspired. He's like, bro, I gotta eat though. Um, I, I don't want to eat um a sports jersey, okay? The vehicle starts to slow down. And Rose gazes out the window, watching the empty buildings flash by. It happened little by little. Okay, here we go. Seriousness. Without any kind of warning, man. People just simply vanished. City became a ghost of his former self, all without anybody noticing. You know, in time, there were none left except for a fortunate few. Or unfortunate, depending on your perspective. We refer to this phenomenon as the incident. Can you understand how we felt? Just like that, everything that we believed in just vanished, gone. Nothing we done mattered anymore. It was like a game that had been reset and the few remaining players had to start from scratch in a sandbox city. You can imagine the initial chaos. Without any kind of authority enforcing order, it was only a matter of time before the riots, the robberies, the killings. We had a lot of that last one here. At least, that's how the disgusting urban legends go. So you don't know. Wait, wait, hold on. What do you mean that that's at least... Huh, wait, how does that make sense? Wait, you can imagine uh, uh, any of, without any authority, with the robins and the killings. Few remaining players still in the city. That's how they were described it. And then just... At least that's how the disgusting urban legends go. What do you mean? But despite all that, we managed to bring peace. You know, we brought... Took a shelter in that castle, fortified our defenses so nobody can cross the river to the south or to the mountains to the north. If we are safe here now, it is because of the blood, sweat, and the tears that we spilled to forge this small alliance. Okay, shawty? Rosemary? Over here getting inspirational? Like, you're... With because of the blood and sweat and tears that we put into this agency, like what? She talking her shit right now. I don't know if y'all can hear my dog barking in the background. You just gonna have to ignore it. I'm sorry. But what if there are more people hidden out there? Could someone cross the river and attack us? Don't really know. Of course, no place in this world is perfectly safe, but we are ready for anything that comes. We have done our best to earn this well-deserved rest, and is our regulations which. Serve as the foundation for a mutual trust that would otherwise be impossible. Bro. Hey, y'all. Can y'all can y'all uh, give me a clap up for my voice acting? Oh, my God. I'm killing these sentences right now. Rose turns your way, showing you a small, uh, a warm smile. That, that soon becomes acidic. <laughs> becomes acidic. That's why we have the right to fool around as much as we want. Got it? Got it. Skrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Nah, I ain't gonna screenshot this. Nah, I am. Alright. I don't know what I'm gonna put with that. Alright, getting out the car, you find yourself in the house. Ain't nobody clicking on that. Um, <laughs> you parted in what seems to be the residential area <laughs> with large gardens. Peering into the distance, you can see a wall of mountains obscuring the horizon. I ain't gonna lie, bro. This is a beautiful... The art. The artist was in the stool with this, bro. Shout out to the developers of this game. You have uh, so far, you have really good writing, and um, the people who who drew this did a really good job. And I, I actually really like the music choice too. So uh, good job to to the Lotus developers. You can see a wall of mountains obscuring the horizon. I might even throw one of these songs in a in a in a video in the future. Hold on. Uh, let me listen to this one. Yeah, that shit is smooth. I ain't gonna lie, that shit is smooth. Yeah, I might use that. It's kind of hot. It's getting hot in here, y'all. We've arrived. This seems to be a normal suburban neighborhood full of medium-sized houses. Definitely not what you were expecting, but still the surprise pales in comparison to the anomaly in the sky that has been plaguing your mind since you left the castle. You cannot help but look back in the direction whence you came. A large black monolith towering up infinitely into the endless sky. We've seen that earlier. That's... Oh. That's the monolith. Where the palace once was. It's pretty close to the castle where we lived, didn't you know? Hmm. Keep giving me clues, Rosemary. It just popped out of the ground when the incident happened. You know, no one has any idea or, or even when it came to be but there it is okay so that's the reason what do you mean they don't know why it came to be it's clearly the reason <laughs> uh i'm sure you have many questions about it but it's not like anyone here else knows the answers either so just, just leave them for later the monolith appears completely out of place anyone would be astonished astonished to see something so massive and otherworldly in the middle of a modern city or well, at least that's how it should be because in your heart, more than shot, you seem to feel. Shinkwe? Are you alright? Uh, no, no, it's uh, it's nothing. You know, I I would I just kind of you know I did just come from there you know I, and just killed a lot of people. It's just that's that's all it is. Your attention shifts back to the others, especially Ryu. He looks to be focusing his gaze on something or another. What's up, Ryu? Sugar overdose? Hold on, hold on. But can I get her on the? Can I? Yeah. Hold on. I want them both not to be. Uh, I want. I want them to be blacked out though. Okay, I know what I can do. Look at this thumbnail possibilities. So I'm a boom. I ain't gonna lie, Rosemary Connor. You know what I'm saying? Then we do. Um. We'll do it again. Ryu scans his surroundings. His arms crossed. All right, and then. Boom. Rosemary kind of bad, y'all. <laughs> oh, try to look cool by showing off your super detective skills. Hi. Hold on, let me. Because he just. Wait, what's up? Real sugar overdose? Ah, uh, it's just that's even possible. Okay. Rose pretends to smoke a cigarette. Makes her It makes her voice as gravelly as she can and gazes into the distance. I've been here of millions of crime scenes like this before. Can't see everything that happened at first glance. <laughs> Some people call it instinct. I call it experience. <sighs> I have a hunch that this investigation could, <sighs> could become <laughs> electrifying. I sound like uh, Mike Wazowski, uh <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for Monsters Inc, bro. Mike was asking. <laughs> uh, dot, dot, dot. Terrible. Hey, that one was actually funny. You get it right, you know, since we've arrived at this uh, let. If you explain the joke, I'll cut you. <laughs> bro, you don't explain the joke, bro. Was that supposed to be an imitation of me? Okay, so he said I'm gravelly? I would have never known this, bro. I would have never known this, bro. Duh, of course. Well, at least it could have been if it could. It, at least it would have been if you actually did your work. You're not even wearing a trench coat. What a disgrace of a detective. 
you know, I could point out a lot of things wrong with that statement. For starters, we haven't actually reached the substation yet. Oh yeah, you, you know, you're wrong about that. This is the electric substation, bitch. So I don't, don't talk to me like that again, Shinkwe. You don't know who the fuck you talking to. Rosemary, I am Rosemary, okay? I know everything. I have every calculation solved out already ahead of time. How dare you try to undermine my calculations? As the super detective, and if you don't believe them, soup. Forget it. While the duo is busy squabbling, you decide to take a closer look with a careful eye. You manage to spot the facade of a house that's somewhat bigger than the rest. It's camouflaged, hiding a completely different interior. If you get closer, you'll discover how the windows are fake as well. There are even ventilation grills hidden here and there. Camouflage substations are more common than you think for two common reasons. The first is, of course, aesthetics. Imagine an ugly industrial building disrupting, uh, disrupting the neighborhood's vibe. But I guess that makes sense, but like, who cares? Because, you know, there's no one that lives here. So what's your what's the point of that? Um, well, that makes sense. I suppose it doesn't. Um, what's their second bullshit reason? What is the purpose of camouflage? I don't know, Captain Obvious, tell me. To hide things I get. Oh, shit! A substation is a very important building since it supplies most of the city's electricity. Camouflage is one method of taking precautions against vandalism. Vandalism? That's why one of the bo- What are they talking about, bro? That's why one of the boss's first decision was to secure all maps and information on crucial, 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 crucial locations like this. I know English, but the power outage still happened. Well, I mean, any in enemy's first thought would be to attack the electrical system. You know, it's the smart one. The only unusual part is how nobody dared to do so before this, unless something changed. Rules casts his gaze on you, clearly disdain in his eyes. Well, I'm trying to think of recall, you know, I don't know who would have done it, you know? I don't think they really gave us a clue. All right, so we have two, I think two mysteries or three mysteries that need to be solved. The first mystery is what was going on at the beginning of the game, bro? Like, what what was really going on? I woke up and I seen a, a lady in white and talked to a lady in black and, and all types of bullshit was going on. I woke up in a room in a hospital bed or something like that. And... Then I started fighting. I started fighting people and shit because I had to do, and then I had to switch off of it. We're not going to do no more fighting if you haven't watched the early episodes because I turned it off. Um, it wasn't too interesting in my opinion. Um, and um, that's the that's the first mystery. The second mystery is um, who was that man that we seen that was standing outside of the monolith in one of those pictures that we have? Um, it should be right here. And we also got the mystery on the blonde headed girl, which I think is something to do with the white, the lady in white. Cause I mean, she was in white. So that might be the same lady, same girl. Um, I'm assuming, I'm assuming that's that, I guess that's not too much of a mystery, but that's not really the, the real mystery is what she was talking about. Like she was saying, uh, like, what have you done? And, and, and stuff like that. And we also, also, we had a teammate when I was playing the fighting game or whatever. We had a teammate and he had a no face or whatever. And he was the one who bashed in somebody's head, which I think ended up with that blind headed girl like talking to us and whatnot. So I guess that let me go get my dog, bro. <laughs> Let's go, super detective. Break the lock. Use your x-ray vision or something like that. Seriously, who gave you these ideas about detectives? Like, <laughs> whoa, I don't like this place. Uh, the music cut off to the nice music. The moment the three of you enter, Rose breaks formation and takes off her own investigation with surprising swiftness. She strides quickly along the big machines, connectors, cables, and assorted paraphernalia you can't even name. You want to ask if there is anything you can do to help, but you're so hesitant to interrupt her intense focus. And in the end, you silently stay a few feet away from her to avoid interfering. Meanwhile, 
Ryu disappear without you even noticing, leaving you stranded in this seamlessly never-ending awkward situation. Well, talk to your talk to Rosemary, bro. Talk. To, why is Rosemary so close right now? Good news, Shinkwe. The, the chance of you being the culprit has dropped significantly. Aren't you glad? Yeah, I am. Rose hangs her arms around your neck, whispering directly into your ear. Rosemary. Rose, you gonna have to chill out a little bit, bro. You can't be doing that. You can't. Isn't that like you know, like maybe sexual harassment unless you want it? It seems a short circuit left the entire city without any power for a few seconds. Then the circuit circuit breaker has tripped and everything returned normal, quickly except for the zone around this castle. So what does that mean then? It means I know exactly where the short circuit must have occurred in the east of the uh, castle. Not that far away from the castle itself. Rosemary, you still too close right now. I ain't gonna lie. That's why you are mostly in the clear. You were discovered approaching the castle from the west wall. It would have been quite a task to short that circuit and then loop around the entire castle in such a short amount of time. All without anybody noticing. I don't know. I, uh, if you've ever watched anime, you'll know that they quite, lead, they quite do the impossible a lot. <laughs> I have an alibi then. Aren't I the best of the best? Though we still have to figure out exactly why the short circuit happened. You know, but we'll cross the bridge when we get to it. Why would the short circuit have happened? I don't think there's anything that we know of. At least not anything I know of. Well, how about the how about the fact that you have um like twenty thousand security cameras in, inside of the inside of that place? That might have something to do with it. <laughs> The fuck like literally 20 in each room <laughs> the line system is old but it's not that easy to create a short circuit all the cables are underground so it's pretty well protected yes they would have had to make the short circuit happen not from here but they would have had to do it from the castle most likely but i wouldn't be in the clear if i managed to do it from a distance or if shinkwe <laughs> wait 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 i ain't even recall really what she said i ain't even recall oh that's funny I had to click on the recall button. But I wouldn't be in the clear. I wouldn't be in the clear if I managed to do it from a distance. Shinkwe is smart. Why is Shinkwe not? I mean, why is Rose like Rose retracts her arm from her shoulder from Huh? Her She had her own arm on her own shoulder? Wait, retract Wait, hold on. Huh? Is that a typo or am I just slow? Okay, Rose hangs her arm around your neck, whispering directly into your ear. And wait, what? And so then retracts her arm retracts her arm from her shoulder i really don't understand that sentence and backs away i don't know i don't re, i don't know how you i don't i don't know how you retract your arm from your shoulder i don't that doesn't make sense to me sounds like you detached it <laughs> <laughs> all right bro what do you mean bro for heaven's sake, I am trying to help you out and cheer you up, but all you do is complicate everything. That's facts, though. She didn't. Shinkwe didn't have to do all that for her. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't really think that through. You don't think much through, apparently, Shinkwe. And you just blurted that out so easily. How do you all manage to stay so calm all the time? Like, you're driving too? You're driving too? Even with all of your nagging and complaining, you were as cool as a cucumber. No, she was not as cool as a cucumber. She was fucking bugging out. And, and thinking she was finna die. She was not as cool as a cucumber. Um, you all, who who else are you talking about? Wait, what? Rose lets out a sigh, taking a second to gather her thoughts. No one in particular, I suppose. That under these circumstances, it isn't so strange to come across people like you. Okay. I was finna say, am I like two people? <laughs> Um, look, putting yourself in a risky situation, you know, and blurting out things that would make your your own case worse is, you know, not normal to say the least. I know, right? That doesn't mean I don't care what happens to me. Of course I care. It's just I can't be oblivious to the facts. I'm not mad at that either. 
Rose plays <laughs> with your cheeks, trying to squeeze your face into a smile. Like this is like this is just nasty at this point. <laughs> then, then I tell. <laughs> Didn't this will tell y'all ass to stop with the don't be doing the booty plan the booty the booty <laughs> Booty shenanigans are not allowed <laughs> Didn't he tell y'all <laughs> Bro that that just that was just too perfect. I had I had to finish the joke, bro You're in such a you're in a much better place compared to five minutes ago. Sure up. I'm I'll I'll find you if you don't Yo, all right Okay, but let me go. Exactly, you're still missing all of the praise and thousands. Thanks, you. Okay, exactly. You are still missing all the praise and thousand thanks. You have yet to sing to your brilliant and incredible, beautiful savior. Oh my god, that is a sentence. I mean, aside from that, what a bore. All right, I'll spare you for now with your. Uh, neg negligent intelligence but I vow to the heavens that I wring that gratitude out of you another day She's so like I'd get just get vibes from her that she just talks like that like big words only for now it should suffice if we simply take a look around our job is to check all the rooms and machines so that we confirm, you know, no tampering has been done, and then we can troubleshoot the problem. And then I'll throw the calculations, and I'll add the five, and, and take it over to the six, and then we should figure out what the short circuit exactly happened. You know, I don't want them to come. Uh, I want me to make me come all the way here just because I didn't give a hundred percent of my attention. Makes sense. I think Ryu is already on the whole checking mission when he split off from us before. Yeah, I don't know where he went. All right, then let's divide the work. To finish as soon as possible and if you see ryu tell him i'm doing my task rose turns around to leave the room but you stop her before she can go hey rose uh yeah hold on bro sorry thank you uh, thank you and what else just thank you <laughs> just thank you if for a second i thought i managed to cure your dullness still no improvement it seems so she's just a happy-go-lucky, enthusiastic all the time person, I guess. No, uh, not long after splitting up, you find Ryu in a remote room focused on some large tubes and cables wrapping around those machines you can't name. The paraphernalia. <laughs> he casts a short, quick glance at you, then his attention returns immediately to the cables. Rose is done. She managed to isolate the zone where the problem must have happened. Best of all, it seems I have an alibi now, so. Ryu doesn't seem to care about what you're saying. Cause he's like, uh, that is not my alibi. I ain't give you no alibi. <laughs> he's like, I don't know what she gave you, but I ain't give you nothing. <laughs> His intense study of these objects piques your interest. Uh, what are you looking at? Ryu sighs and scratches his ass. Obviously annoyed. Can we leave then? You nod, but can't take your eyes off his strange and uncharacteristic behavior yes itch uh something wrong like you need to go take a shower or something like wipe your ass maybe nothing i uh, just can't think like have you noticed like there is something off here like uh, i can't be the only one you step closer to ryu hold on hold on do not be stepping too close to ryu i need you to get with rosemary bruh Hold on. Notice anything abnormal about these cables? What do you mean? You haven't realized it yet, you fucking dumbass. You shuffle closer and closer, wondering if it might be an issue with perspective, maybe? <laughs> when you moved right next to him, your shoulder almost bumping him. Okay, you know, Shinkwe, calm down. Shinkwe, calm down. Okay, we are apparently getting in everybody's face today. I was talking about you. Fuck. Oh, shit. What? Out of the blue, he grabs your wrist. Ow, that actually hurt. His grip painfully, his grip painfully tight. The world before your eye, your eyes spins as he pulls you into a perfect grapple hold, making you stagger and lose your balance. Isn't this a, uh... do you need to be canceled for this, sir? You cannot just grab women like this. 
You fucking fiend? He twists you around. What is he, what is he doing? Before you can resist until you are forced to face the machines on the wall. Exerting complete control over your arm, he slowly drags it towards one of the uninsulated cables he has been focusing on. Ooh, 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 ooh. The uninsulated ones. Ooh, ooh. From your head's current position locked under his arm, you can't see the cables. You resist his pull with all of your strength, all while trying to convince him of your innocence. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Rose said that that does not matter, Shinkwe. You yell as loud as you can, ah, ah, struggling in every way possible, but he lifts you up, up, up your feet. Wait, until your feet are barely touching the ground, until you, until you don't have the support to apply any force. What the hell is this nigga, Hulk? How much do I weigh? 70 pounds? The, the problem isn't so much anything you did, per se. It's your fucking existence. Everything we've built, the trust we had, where is that shit now? You just had to fucking come out of nowhere with that. With you, you you brought that return of a possibility when we had to finally manage to discard after all of this fucking time. Now, it's just a matter of time before doubt is born amongst us self. Before the shattering of this status quo we've worked so hard to create is gone. Don't bother asking if you're innocent or... Don't bother asking if you're innocent or guilty. You're better off thinking for as a reason why I or anyone else shouldn't just end your life at any moment we wish. Okay, uh, I might have a, a good one. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Uh, that's that's. I think that is a perfectly good reason why you shouldn't end my life. That's like killing an insane person or killing somebody who needs mental help. You know, I kind of don't know what I did, sir. That's. A, I think that's a perfectly good reason, you know? A perfectly good one, actually. You know, no fall at all. Your body trembles. Your supply of adrenaline beginning to run out. There's likely not much. What? Where is uh, Rosemary? Is she just gonna fucking twiddle her 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 fucking thumbs in 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 a fucking? What is she doing right now? There's likely not much time left before he forces your fingers to touch the cables. The justice, you'll be all right. Okay, I guess you won't actually. This this, this does supply like a whole building. Uh, the justice you were so used to it, um, uh, too, is over, Shinkwe. Welcome to the real world. Damn, bro, this nigga does not want to Oh, right. Guys, man, that is going to be the end of this episode. Sorry that had to end off so abruptly, but we're going to continue on the next episode. Hopefully that's just, it's just going to be real juicy when we get back into it. It was just starting to actually pop off. But my damn footage had to end, bro. Dead ass. I can only record up to an hour. So that, that when it when it gets to an hour of, of my footage on the tape, it'll end automatically. So my jump ended. So now I'm gonna have to uh I'm gonna just do this little intro. I mean this outro I meant and uh yeah, so Alright guys, that's gonna be the end of this episode. So happy for the guys who tuned in to watch, man. Make sure you like and subscribe only if this video kept you interested. Only. If this video kept you interested, and peace.